Welcome to Six Figs, I'm Kyle, and in today's video, folks, we're talking about the one and only Nervos Network, CKB. Let's dive right into this, folks. So, they are having a hackathon. Nervos Network is partnered up with CK Bull Wallet to bring you the CK Bull Hackathon, baby. Now, this thing's kicking off August 21st and running to September 3rd. So if you know a developer or you have friends that are developers or you know your friends' friends have developers, encourage them to participate and claim their stake of the 1.5 million CKB. Now, there is also an AMA coming up with a one and only folks, Jordan Mac Daddy, baby. Now, I have had the pleasure of knowing Jordan for quite some time. And let me tell you guys this. He is one of the best in the business. So, there is going to be an AMA August 22nd, 1030 AM Pacific time. And Jordan will be on Reddit doing an AMA. So, like I said, he's one of the best in the business. It should be a good one. Now, with the halving coming up, folks, in three months, people are getting really excited, especially Nervos Network. This is a very historical milestone, as they put it. And it is, because what happens when a halving occurs? Well, less supply is being awarded to the miners or introduced into the ecosystem. So it kind of has this deflationary effect, but things are still inflationary. It's just not as inflationary. What is this going to do for the price? We're going to talk about that in just a second. After we get on from Cypher Wang's Joy ID. Now, I've had the privilege of meeting Cypher, previously brilliant guy, and what he's done with Joy ID is taking things to the next level. Joy ID is now chain agnostic wallet. It's a true game changer. No password, no mnemonics, no installation, decentralized, self sovereign. Like I said, chain agnostic chain agnostic folks that is a huge accomplishment so support joy id folks this is great uh with that said we're going to be talking about the markets right now excuse me uh we can see that ckb hmm, has been pumping quite some the last few days but we're down 6.3 on the percent so what exactly is happening well, it's been a couple weeks, and I couldn't believe it's been a couple weeks since my last CKB video, and I'm really going to try to crank out at least two a week, especially as we start to kind of wiggle into the next bull run. Uh, we definitely want to be on top of it, but really, folks, you know, we've been in the sideways trading pattern for like the last two or three weeks, and I hate to just create videos to get views and to waste people's time. But the last time I was speculating is that we were going to see maybe some sort of blast off occur. And you can see this interesting trend line that I drew. We recognize that there was this trend of price hitting certain areas. And price did break out of this descending triangle here. Although it came down to retest this trend line, it decided to take off. Now, what exactly is going on here? Well, I would like to think that, folks, this is very, very classic uh, Elliott Wave Theory Impulse. And we know that because we can see this. So right now we're looking at the four-hour chart, and I am expecting maybe some sort of a retracement, maybe down to play tag with this 200 moving average. Uh, you know what? Let's just do a little Fibonacci here. You know, I could see this thing maybe coming down to the 0 .003027 ish level. This is not financial or trading advice, but somewhere in that neighborhood. And if we do end up with an A, B, C, D, E pattern, you know, we could easily see this uh, 0 .003 ish region. Um, but my hope here is that we do not see some sort of of bullish Gartley uh, harmonic pattern, something like that. So right now, I definitely don't want to see price go any lower than 0 0.002965 because what does that mean? It means that we could be gearing up for some sort of um, you know move to the downside temporarily. Good news is this is all on the four-hour chart, so it's not like this prolonged... Um, uh, pattern that's playing out over a long period of time. 
So that is kind of what I'm watching right now at the moment. I'm hoping to get a bounce right around that 0 0.003 level, but if we fall lower than this 0.002965-ish level, I'm going to be really eyeballing to see if CKB breaks this 0 0.002856 level. If it does, it will invalidate the harmonic. So um, we are on watch right now for this, so know that much. Let's look at the weekly chart and just see where things are at. Weekly, it's been bullish the last three weeks, folks. And really, I like in my last videos on this weekly, I was speculating on how I would like to see this price run up to 0.00351-ish and tag this 50 moving average on the weekly. Because if we can get price above this weekly average and then shoot through this thin part of the Ichimoku cloud on the weekly charts, folks, my goodness, we are going to see CKB fly. Um, but we need to play the waiting game over the next few days, possibly into the end of this week, to see if that harmonic pattern that I was just telling you about develops. Uh, I'm hoping it doesn't. I'm hoping what we end up seeing is this little run to the upside. I'm hoping we get this little retracement and then I hope we go on uh, up higher. But un until you know we see what happens here, uh, we don't want to play with fire. So if you guys want to join my trading group on Open Chat, it's free. And well, once the group hits 500 members, I'll be giving away five or 50 ICP to one random person out of that 500 uh, member group. So you have a one in 500 chance of winning 50 ICP, which is 200 bucks. So we discuss a lot of chart work and market sentiment and things like that in that channel. Uh, but I love you all. And don't forget, folks, to check out Nervos Nation, folks. I will leave a link in the description and the pinned comment. They are the lifeblood of the CKB community. And it's they've got a great Telegram group uh, and, and Twitter account that basically helps onboard people in the nervous network ecosystem and it really does a good job of answering questions you know that community camaraderie uh they've got it all there so i love you guys all and we'll see you on the next video